dog bark messed up my video. Last train of thought, the last one. Dumb dog. Um, the reason I'm doing a video is one I found out yesterday. There's a limit to how much you can do a text comment. And I watch a lot of videos. Um, you guys are my only outside world. And, uh, so I didn't want to, well, I have a lot to say, I usually do. I, I, I'm choosing to do video comments and short comments. I'm doing, um, the text comments. And, uh, the reason that I popped on here is, Chris, you had made a comment that you couldn't have any close YouTube friends. And that offends me because I'm not Shelly. I didn't cause this drama, and I feel like I'm being compared to Shelly. And that's not fair. You wouldn't want me to compare you to a lesbian down the street, or or um, to a single mom, or to somebody I knew, whatever. And I don't even know Shelly. You know, I I haven't even got to know Shelly, so you know, I feel offended by the fact that. Um, that I would be, you know, I'm hoping to have a close relationship with, with you and with others out here, and um, to see that you wouldn't have that kind of relationship with another YouTuber hurts. Um, and you know, if if you want to background check me, I will give you all the information. I will give you my social security number. I will give you my state ID number. And I will send you any verification you need to know. I am an open book. Um, and if anything that I've said on here you want to have verification for, you let me know. I will send it. Plain and simple. Now as for this whole Shelly thing, um, I have something to say about that too. And I'm going to say it allegedly only because I personally have not seen the physical data to support it. Nor do I want to see the physical data that supports this. Am I saying Chris is lying? No. But still, as it may be, for someone to go to the extent <coughs> that you did shows to me on a psychological lever, level, sorry I can't talk, that you are not happy with your life. For whatever reason, you do not think your life is interestingly interesting enough to share on YouTube <clears throat> that you need to create drama. Um, I have known people that have done this. My brother is one of them. I have a brother who will do that. He, uh, at my father's funeral, said that he was under a surgeon. I've never seen any proof of that. And he lied about many things before, accidents that didn't happen, um, saying that my brother was killed in the Gulf War, weird goofy stuff that he would make up. Anyway, um, so yeah, it's a horrible disease that you got yourself into, making up lies like that. And it got you nowhere. And I feel sad for you, and I hope in your journey toward wellness that you get some help for that. Because it's not going to bring you anything. It's not going to bring you excitement. It's not going to make you friends. Nothing. You know, um, from what Denise had said, you had made a lie about having adopting twins and um, having a Hall of Fame husband. You know, we don't care. We are simple people on a road to recovery. Would it be great if uh, Oprah decided to join our community? Sure. Would it be exciting if Connie Wilson decided to join our community? Awesome. But as it goes, we are simple people. Even if we had Connie Wilson and Oprah Winfrey, we are simple people on a journey toward recovery. We don't need all the hoopla. We don't need any of that. And so, I hope you get help. I honestly do. I do not judge you as a person. As a person, I'm sure you are a great person. You're just a person who needs help and has made some bad decisions. And I love you as God loves you. 
Um, and Chris, I hope you reconsider your current statement that you and I or you and somebody else in the YouTube world can't become close friends because of what Shelly did because I'm not Shelly. I don't look like Shelly. Um, I don't act like Shelly. At least I don't think I do. I didn't watch her enough to really know that. But anyway, if you want to background me, background check me, you let me know. I will send you via personal email all the information you want. And if by chance you want to steal my credit, which I'm not saying you would, but if you do, can you let me know how you got credit off my name? Because I can't get credit off my name. Um, but yeah, I can tell you anything you want to know. But I also have one other thing for you. Um, we're looking for my husband's brother. Haven't seen him in like 10 years. Yeah, any tips on how we can find him? Because in my poor butt, I can't afford to like pay for all these things to find him. And I don't know his social security number or driver's license or anything. I just know his name. And I can't find him. And my husband would like to say hi and how you doing and, and uh, all of that. And if anybody knows a Victor Asher Jr., um, let me know, uh, cause, uh, my husband would, is his brother and he'd like to say hi. So, um, yeah, he hasn't seen him, uh, for a very long time and, uh, he just kind of dropped out of the family and, uh, my husband would just like to say hi. And since you're a private eye kind of person, I thought maybe you could give me some tips on how to find this person without costing me an arm and a leg. Um, but anyway, I hope that all this dust settles even now with this new dust with Shelly um, because this is not what this community was started for and it would be a shame to see it go to heck just because of a few people. Um, God loves you. I love you. Goodbye.